Hello and welcome. Uh, this video is about a program which I came across uh, and is available at this site. I'll put the uh, sodium.org and it's called Easy Context Menu. And I wanted a program where when you right click on your desktop uh, to add uh, a shortcut like that or in your file or folder or a, a folder and you want to keep um, for example this one um, I, I didn't know how to go about doing it and this neat little program does it for you uh, it's free where easy context menu one version 1.5 and this video was made on the 8th uh, April 2015 and as you can see it does all this um, right click stuff and you can have options for desktop context menu my computer context menu, drives context menu, folder context menu file, system tools etc and turn off okay and uh, pictures show what it does and basically uh, what you do is you it supports uh, these operating systems so you can do it on Windows 7, Windows 8.1 which is what I wanted so I've got Windows 8.1 and Windows 7 which is this machine and you download it from here and it's a zip file which is this one right? and it's about 1.55 megabytes you extract it and you get this menu and there's these files in there, README and these two. Okay. Um, now, obviously, I think this must be for 64-bit machine. It uh, doesn't matter which one, but if you click on this uh, icon, ask you for the um, password, admin password. I'll type. And um, I've tested it, and it seems to be fine. And you get this. So you get apply changes which is right click on your right mouse uninstall all list editor context menu cleaner and about obviously you have to follow the instructions in the help and on their website there's a donate button if you want to donate I've got no um, affiliation with this company nor any any unless I'm mentioning in the video on my videos uh, these are all Purely uh, as you can freely available on the internet. Uh, if you click on the um, list editor, you get this menu. Now, I wanted to add uh, a shortcut for this program, and I've added it there. And you select it by you add click add, and then you find uh, your program. Which say I uh, do that one click OK and it comes up there right and it gives automatically gives the title and it says it'll put it in the desktop menu context menu and there's a list of others options so for example it's al already put it in the in this one and um, then I'm going to add new and same thing add and say I want it on the folder option just just you can put any one really and it's gone in the folder context menu and there it is and then what you do is once you're happy with all this um, where you know you put it another one for file uh, folder drives etc you save the changes and it gives you an icon automatically or you can add your own from by selecting this uh, and your program you select from there and it automatically gives you a title and then you put the target and then you put it where you want it whether you want to when you right click do you want to just show in the middle of the menu so I've left it there you can change it to the top of the menu or bottom and uh, left that as it is so save changes 
okay and then close that and then what you do is you apply and it makes that noise and then when you minimize it if I right click on it now and it'll and there's your uh, this should be a context menu should be one let's try on your desktop no it's not done it yet so try that again so list editor I've selected it there uh, let's do it on your computer as well add that one on my computer um, add say on the top save close apply I think you might have to check the head as well, just make sure it's selected. No, it hasn't, that's why. So when you come back to this, you have to select it here as well. And um, select the context menu there. And on, on here, pretty easy really. And then you apply. And when I minimize it, it's, 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 it's it comes up. Hopefully, there it is. Bingo. And when you do it on your folder or your computer, it should come up there as well. There it is on the top. Very good. And if I do it on, say, pictures on the folder, it's there. Now, when I want to get rid of it, I just go back, just take that off. If I say, I'll take that one and right click on it and you can, I think you can, yeah you just untick it from there. If I do uninstall all and you just select it from there, the ones I want. So now when I go back, I've got that one there, and on your desktop, there, they scored the other one. So yeah, see what you think. Yeah, it's the program. Easy context menu, version 1.1, .1, free. Thanks for watching, bye for now.